Hello everyone, hello grade 5. Our lesson today is dividing fractions. Example, divide 3 over 4 divided by 9 over 16. The nice key to divide two fractions is K, C, F. K means what guys? Means keep. C means change. F means flip. That's mean 3 over 4 divided by 9 over 16 equals. Keep the first fraction as it is. It will be 3 over 4. Change the sign of division to be multiply flip the second fraction to be 16 over 9 now cancel out the common factors divided by 3 equals 1 divided by 3 equals 3 divided by 4 equals 1 divided by 4 equals 4 now multiply the remaining factors equals 1 times 4 over 1 times 3 it will be 4 over 3 don't forget the nice key K means what? Keep. C means change. F means flip. To find the reciprocal of the fraction, just flip it. If we have a fraction and it's reciprocal, the reciprocal of 2, it will be 1 half. The reciprocal of 2 over 3, it will be 3 over 2. Reciprocal of 7 over 4, it will be 4 over 7. Don't forget, the reciprocal of 1, it will be the same. 0 has no reciprocal example find the quotient of 4 over 5 divided by 1 over 2 equals keep the first fraction as 4 over 5 multiply the reciprocal of the second it will be 2 now no common factors just multiply the two numerators over the two denominators 4 times 2 it will be 8 5 times 1 it will be 5 so the quotient here it will be 8 over 5 8 over 5 is an improper fraction we can write it as 1 and 3 over 5. Second, 1 over 6 divided by 1 over 12 equals 1 over 6. Multiply the reciprocal of the second, it will be 12. Now, cancel out the common factors. Divided by 6 equals 1. Divided by 6 equals 2. It will be 1 times 2 equals 2. Next, 4 over 10 divided by 6 over 10 equals just multiply the first fraction by the reciprocal of the second one it will be 4 over 10 times the reciprocal of the second it will be 10 over 6 now cancel out the common factors divided by 10 equals 1 divided by 10 equals 1 4 and 6 are divisible by 2 we can divide by 2 here divided by 2 equals 2 divided by 2 equals 3 now multiply the remaining factors it will be 2 2 times 1 over 1 times 3. Now the quotient equals 2 over 3. We can deduce the rule. To divide two fractions, just multiply the first fraction by the reciprocal of the second one. In other words, we can say A over B divided by C over D. Keep the first one, which is A over B, multiply the reciprocal of the second, it will be D over C equals A times D over B times C. Now, ask yourself, how can you divide by a mixed number? Just change the mixed number to be an improper fraction and apply the same rule. For example, 1 and 1 half divided by 3 and 3 over 4. We can now convert 1 and 1 half as an improper fraction. Just multiply 1 times 2 plus 1. It will be 3 3 over 2 divided by 3 times 4 plus 3 it will be 15 over 4 now we can divide the two fractions keep the first one as 3 over 2 multiply the reciprocal of the second it will be 4 over 15 we can now cancel the common factors divided by 2 equals 1 divided by 2 equals 2 divided by 3 equals 1 divided by 3 
3 equals 5. It will be 2 over 5. Example complete. What number divided by 3 over 7 equals 7 over 12? The first number is called what guys? Yes, it's called dividend. Second is divisor. The last one, 7 over 12, it will be the quotient. The missing number here is a dividend. How can you find the dividend? Just multiply the quotient by the divisor. So, dividend equals 7 over 12 times 3 over 7. Now, cancel out the common factors. Divided by 7 equals 1. Divided by 7 equals 1. 12 and 3 are divisible by 3. Divided by 3 equals 1. Divided by 3 equals 4. Now, multiply the remaining factors. It will be 1 over 4. If you like my video, subscribe to my channel. Channel. Thank you for watching. See you soon, guys.